Hello, I'm your friend, Teacher Sam. Today we embark on an exciting journey of self-improvement, a journey to enhance your English communication skills all by yourself. English, as we all know, is the global language, a ticket to a world without borders. It's the language of the internet, of business, of diplomacy, and of culture. Being proficient in English opens up a multitude of opportunities, both personal and professional. It allows you to connect with people from different parts of the world, broadens your perspective, and even boosts your confidence. But most importantly, it's a skill that you can improve on your own, at your own pace, in your own space. Today, we're going to explore some simple yet effective strategies to help you become a better English communicator. So, buckle up and get ready for an enlightening ride. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear path to improving your English communication skills. The first step to improving your English communication skills is to engage daily in English. Just like learning to play a musical instrument or mastering a sport, practice makes perfect. And when it comes to language learning, daily immersion is the name of the game. Start by reading English articles. It could be a news piece, a blog post, or even a simple comic strip. This not only improves your reading comprehension, but it also exposes you to different contexts and expressions used in English. Next, tune into English podcasts or radio shows. Listening to native speakers converse naturally can significantly improve your understanding of English intonations and accents. Finally, make it a habit to speak English. Find a language exchange partner or simply narrate your day in English. The more you speak, the more confident you'll become. Remember, the key is consistency and daily practice. Your English communication skills will surely flourish with this approach. Step 2. Enhance your vocabulary. One of the foundational blocks to becoming a proficient English speaker is having a rich and varied vocabulary. The wider your vocabulary, the more precise and expressive you can be in your communication. Now, how do you build this vocabulary? First, immerse yourself in English literature, novels, newspapers, blogs, anything you can get your hands on. Reading not only introduces you to new words, but also presents them in context, helping you understand their usage. Second, turn to flashcards. Write a new word on one side, its meaning on the other. Review these cards regularly, and before you know it, these words will become a part of your everyday language. Lastly, don't underestimate the power of the good old dictionary. Whenever you stumble upon a word you don't understand, look it up. This habit can dramatically increase your vocabulary over time. Remember, a robust vocabulary can significantly enhance your English communication skills. The third step is to improve your pronunciation. Pronunciation is the cornerstone of effective communication in any language, and English is no exception. When your pronunciation is clear, you are easily understood, and this leads to meaningful conversations. But how do you improve your pronunciation? Well, there are a few methods that you can employ. First, start by listening and repeating. You can do this by watching English movies, listening to English songs, or even listening to English podcasts. This will help you familiarize yourself with the sounds and rhythms of English. Next, consider using pronunciation guides. There are many available online that give you the phonetic spelling of words. Lastly, don't shy away from practicing tongue twisters. They're not just fun, but they also help improve the flexibility and agility of your tongue, contributing to better pronunciation. Remember, practice makes perfect. The fourth and final step is to learn grammar. Grammar is the backbone of any language, and English is no exception. It is the set of rules that governs how we structure our sentences and conveys accurate meaning. Without a solid understanding of grammar, we run the risk of miscommunication and misunderstanding no matter how extensive our vocabulary or perfect our pronunciation. Consider grammar as the framework on which we build our language skills. It's like the blueprint of a house. You can have all the best materials, but without a blueprint, those materials won't form a sturdy and functional house. Similarly, words and pronunciation are the materials, but grammar is the blueprint. So, how can we learn and improve our grammar? There are several effective methods. First, grammar books are a traditional and reliable resource. They provide detailed explanations and plenty of exercises to practice what you've learned. Whether it's understanding verb tenses, mastering the use of prepositions, or learning the correct sentence structure, grammar books have it all. Next, the internet is a treasure trove of resources. There are countless websites, apps, and online courses dedicated to teaching English grammar. These platforms often incorporate multimedia elements like videos, quizzes, and interactive exercises, making learning grammar engaging and fun. 
And last but certainly not least, practice writing sentences. Writing is a powerful tool for learning grammar. It allows you to apply what you've learned and spot your mistakes. Start with simple sentences, then gradually move on to complex ones. Don't worry about making mistakes, they are an integral part of the learning process. Remember, learning grammar is not a one-time event, but a continuous process. It might seem daunting at first, but with consistent practice and patience, you'll see noticeable improvement in your English communication skills. A solid grasp of grammar is essential for effective English communication. To recap, we've covered four main steps to improve your English communication skills by yourself. We started with the importance of engaging daily in English, immersing yourself in the language through reading, writing, or even thinking in English. We then moved on to enhancing your vocabulary, building your word bank through various methods like flashcards or language apps. Next, we focused on improving pronunciation, ensuring you're understood clearly and correctly. We explored various tools and techniques to help you master the sounds of English. And finally, we delved into learning grammar, the rules that govern the language, and how understanding it can significantly improve your communication. Throughout, we've emphasized the importance of consistency and practice. Like any skill, improving your English communication takes time and effort, but with each day, each word, each sentence, you are making progress. Remember, every step you take to improve your English communication skills opens up new opportunities. So, keep practicing, and you'll see the benefits in no time.